Oh, you guys were expecting the blue hedgehog? Well, not today. Today is crash time. You guys read the title, you know what's up. There is now current controversy and drama between these two plush tubers, Cool Mario Bros and Super Sonic Amazing. What do I have to do with the situation? Absolutely nothing, I just wanted the views. I'm not even gonna lie. Well, actually, I kinda do have some relevance in here. In case you guys don't remember, four months ago, to the timing of this video, I made a video regarding the Sonic plush community, or just plush communities and Sonic communities separately, but it was still the same thing. Long story short, I told you so. But let's get back into the two plush tubers. On this side, we have Cool Mario Bros, who has a lot of evidence regarding the things that had happened between him and Super Sonic Amazing. Supposedly, from what I know, after watching the video, Super Sonic Amazing is a bit of a loudmouth. He says a lot of things, and very controversial things, and also very mean things. I'll play the clip for you guys right now. There's a video of him telling my friend to go hang himself. So I keep saying that, right? But Bro, dude. Shut See, I can't say anything without this idiot unmuting me. Shut the fuck up. Kill yourself. Go jump off a cliff. Go point a gun to your head. And then just... You gotta be ashamed of yourself, nigga. Real talk. You gotta be ashamed of yourself. All as you will. Now, according to Cool Mario Bros, Supersonic Amazing has been acting like this for no reason. But this is where we get into the blurry part of the situation. According to Super Sonic Amazing, in his video, he defends himself saying that he has said those things, but there's a reason behind them. And it's because Cool Mario Bros supposedly was also talking crap about him. We're back with another video. Today we're going to be exposing this person named Cool Mario Bros. Some of the stuff he said in this in the video was true, but he forgot one simple thing. So I was on a live stream. Well, no, I was not on a live stream. Cool Mario Bros, Blue Burn Friends, Hypersonic 33 were on a live stream together. And, uh, yeah. And they were talking mad shits about me. Oh, yeah, I also forgot to mention that he made this comment saying, at least my dad is alive. Like, this motherfucker. Oh, my God, I'm honestly tired of people. You gotta be ashamed of yourself, nigga. Now I want to talk to you guys about something regarding these two. Don't go choosing sides. We don't know who's right and who's wrong. But at the end of the day, we're just people who play with dolls for videos. Situations like these could be avoided easily. This is bullying 101. If somebody's saying something to you that you don't like, you could easily just back away or just tell them. And if it's just not working, just cut the person off. Other than that, I have been trying to take the initiative. I did add both Supersonic Amazing and Cool Mario Bros on Discord. I have yet to get a request back. But for you guys who are choosing sides between Cool Mario Bros and Supersonic Amazing, please don't because we don't know what's going on and it's an argument between two kids, literally. The best thing for us viewers to do is to stand aside and not choose sides and let the two handle it themselves. Plain and simple. But until then, Cool Mario Bros looks like he's in the safety because he has a lot of evidence and proof and Super Sonic Amazing has yet to show any proof that he has at all. Because apparently to his words, he said that he has experienced them saying stuff to him and that he also has witnesses, but those witnesses need to step it up to show that they were there and seen what he did to Super Sonic Amazing. But most of you guys were there. I'm pretty sure I know a few people that were there. And Phantom is a witness because he, no, well not Phantom was talking shit. But Hyper, BBAF, and CMB were talking shit. And like, yeah. But I caught his ass in 4K. Actually, I caught all of them three motherfuckers in 4K, bro. Regardless of the matter, situations like these could be handled way better and more maturely. Moral of the story, if you don't like somebody, don't talk to them. Or if you're friends with them and you got a problem, genuinely talk to them and don't try to make them feel like crap. Anyways, guys, it's been Crash Bandicoot. Really Zach to Coop because I didn't want to show my face, so I'm just showing this freaking. <laughs> Subscribe if you haven't.